Right, in this video, I'm not getting any gas mileage or the amount of petrol miles per gallon in the UK, as we call it, that I'm get, I should be getting. I normally can get 65 miles per gallon uh, diesel, uh, but I'm not getting that. And one of the things that could help quickly improve that situation, well, if your pistons are worn, then there's nothing you can do about it. But apart from changing the piston uh, linings and piston rings, but if it's a simple case of your math sensor being uh, filled up with a uh, crud, is a good word I think, and you'll ban me on YouTube saying that. Then you can just clean the math sensor, and on a Ford Focus 1.5 TDCI 2015, it should be just there where this plug is. I can't remember, I must have taken it off before, but I am also going to be changing the oil filter in another video, so I don't mind taking it all apart just to get it. So let's unplug it first so we don't strain it. One of these, I think this should be, yeah, it's not going to come out, so it's safe to turn these. One of these kind of springy screwdrivers with a 7mm ends are really useful. I can flip that around and make it lead mill. So I forgot to mention you do need a low residue or no residue electrical cleaner and to, to clean something like uh, math sensor you need something that doesn't leave any residue whatsoever. If it's liquid and it's it's a bit of a solvent and it would just disperse any kind of carbon build up on there. I could do this in normal time. The screws that don't fall out, like for example, the time belt cover, the top cover, is for inspection. Here's this. Just give us a little check. Look at that massive floor. Huge. Lots of area. Lots of area for me to use, and it looks pretty good. I didn't do it so long ago, so that exposes that bit. Let's have a look. Right. So the moving around. So from this angle, might be able to see it better. Um, this tray will come out. Oh if you can see where my finger is yet but undo this strap that releases that so now if I take this off That is bad. Why didn't I not do this before? It is really covered in muck. Let me get a better. There is a vacuum hose attaches to a little nozzle just here, vacuum hose, pull that off. And it's just pull, pull, comes up. Yeah, right. So, we'll get you some better light here. And them little kind of resistors on this end need to be cleaned out as well. So, I think I will take it off 
affects this. The reason I took it apart and said so just doing it by uh, spraying it in where I could see it is because I'm not sure. Normally there's like a, like a resistor with two ends to it. And I could just see like one funny resistor, one cable. Don't understand it. Anyway, this is a, that's a eight mil, eight mil. Uh, and this one is a T20. Right. So you just got to remember which way around it goes. Uh, that won't fit that way, so it's idiot proof. Do not put, that's the magnetic tray, do not put the sensor on the magnet. Who knows what damage that will do, but it's worth putting the screws on there. And they're not even ferrous. So it makes has no effect. I'm doing it here in case it falls off and I can catch it. It's like a little tray, isn't it? Okay, that came off easily. Right, now we can have a proper look. I've never done this one on this car. Everything just shows me that little one there. From this side, from this side you can see the dirt on it. Can you see it? Shine light in it. On this side you can see the copper. It's a lot cleaner and that is it. There's no other bit to it, but let's spray it down. Let's spray it down with electrical. Do this nice and early so in any jobs you're gonna do, so you've got plenty of time for it to dry. Uh, let's see if I see any holes. You can see the stronger the spray and this kind is kind of running out. Whoops, I'm not even showing you the camera. Oh yeah, I should have that blue. Blue bubble will come back. And that is resistor. Don't touch it. There's plenty on there. Delicate stuff, spray it down a bit as well. Didn't draw any dirt back into it. Must be getting another bottle of this. Right, so I'm going to put that back together, a bit more dirt this side, put it back together and let it dry. Right, if you uh, like this video please hit like subscribe but given it over time I'm going to put down what, um, what I'm getting miles per gallon now spraying down this cover that's what I'm doing I'm talking don't want any of that any of that dirt getting in your so I'm gonna get some brake cleaner on this thing. Any of that getting in there. So let it dry, clean that off thoroughly. None of those but dust particles can venture or allow to be ventured into the injectors or there'll be trouble. Alright, please hit like subscribe button. And uh, I shall put over a period of time what miles per gallon I'll be getting.